This week we're in Scotland, land of the brave, where a fledgling cowboy has left behind the biggest build we've ever taken on. That's it over there, isn't it? Yeah. Isn't that a blot on a beautiful landscape, all that scaffolding? Looks like one hell of a job, though. We should get going. Yeah, come on. In. On the outskirts of Glasgow sits the sleepy hillside village. This really is someone who's starting off on the wrong track, and if he's not stopped, he's just going to get worse. And he's going to end up becoming a full time mature cowboy builder that does this for the rest of his life. Coming up. I uncover a piece of evidence that blows this whole case wide open. And I discover what months of Scottish weather does to a timber frame. No change, no change. We've been here, it's half eight now, two hours. My legs are like icicles. Get out of bed. Minus two and a half degrees. I've now been sitting here five hours. Engine side, Bravo One's opening the door. I get the word from my surveillance team. Right, one's on the move. The next round about the first and first. I've spotted his van, and my team tell me he's inside the builder's merchants. Van's popped up, he's gone into the shop. Guys, let's get out now. Get him when he comes out. We had a date, you stood me up. Listen, don't be in a hurry to go away, mate. We've got a lot of things we've got to talk about here, isn't there? Listen, why haven't you had a date? Nice to meet you. <sighs> there goes a cowboy builder for you. After chasing him for so long, I'm gutted. Got away. 